In Belgium, a man was pulled over by police during a routine traffic stop. Despite no drinking, he exhibited all the signs of intoxication, including slurred speech and difficulty following instructions. Suspecting that he might be driving under the influence of alcohol, the officers administered a breathalyzer test. To his surprise, it showed a significant blood alcohol level. It all started when he started experiencing some very strange symptoms that left both him and his doctors scratching their heads. At first, he dismissed the feelings of dizziness, fatigue and confusion as just the result of stress and a busy lifestyle. Soon things took a bizarre turn. He began to feel drunk, even though he hadn't touched a drop of alcohol. These unsettling episodes included slurred speech and trouble with coordination, raising alarm bells for both him and his family. To get to the bottom of his condition, he sought medical help, but the standard test did not provide any clear answers. The police incident also led to further investigations into his health, ultimately revealing that he suffers from a very special condition called Otto Browery Syndrome ABS. So what exactly is Otto Browery Syndrome? Well, ABS is a peculiar medical condition where the body produces alcohol internally like a brewery. This happens due to an overgrowth of yeast in the gut. When the person eats carbohydrates, the yeast ferments those sugar, turning them into alcohol. Which which then enters the bloodstream. As a result, individuals can end up with high blood alcohol levels without ever drinking alcohol, and the effects can range from confusion and drowsiness to impaired motor skills. Living with Otto Browery syndrome isn't easy. Those affected face the constant worry of unexpectedly feeling intoxicated, which can complicate personal relationships and work life. For our Belgian men, life had to change dramatically. He learned to avoid foods high in carbohydrates and had to stay on the top of regular medical checkups. After a series of tests, including breathalyzer assessments and gastrointestinal examinations, doctors confirmed his diagnosis. They recommended significant lifestyle changes, including dietary adjustments and antifungal treatments to reduce the yeast overgrowth in his gut. Thankfully, these measures helped improve some of his symptoms and boost his overall health. However, ABS doesn't just go away, and he still faces daily challenges managing his condition.